So we're here on Ocracoke Island um, on the Outer Banks of North Carolina uh, and on the edge or beside the, the Monitor National Marine Sanctuary. And uh, basically we're here as Project Baseline to work with NOAA to, to uh, document two wrecks uh, that occurred in World War II uh, in the, what's called the Battle of the Atlantic. In this case we, we brought uh, the ship along with our two submersibles, Nemo and Nomad, uh, that are a thousand foot rated two person submersibles. And then we have, of course, our technical dive support system. Uh, what NOAA is, is brought in is, of course, the archeologists. Um, the subs have been outfitted with, uh, with state of the art laser scanning systems. So what we're doing is we are combining inertial navigation, which is an aerospace technology with uh, uh, subsea acoustic positioning to get extremely high accuracy and we combine that very accurate navigation with super high resolution laser profiling and by doing so we can create 3D uh, models of the U-boat with a resolution on the order of millimeters. So it's a, it's a really big project with a lot of different moving parts that uh, people are doing going in the subs to do different types of studies on the bottom uh, in addition to the laser scanning and the photogrammetry. So we're, um, we're working with a group of archaeologists from NOAA that have been studying this area for many years. Um, some of them, their, most of their careers, trying to understand exactly what happened and be able to recreate and tell that story of the Battle of the Atlantic. And one of, uh, one of the, the events that rose to the top on their list was a convoy that was attacked by a German U-boat called the U-576. Um, it, it sank a uh, merchant ship called the Bluefields, and as it turns out, the U-boat and the Bluefields sank almost next to each other on the, on the bottom of the seafloor. And so that's why we're here. We're here to work with NOAA to go out and see these wrecks for the first time since 1942 and the Battle of the Atlantic when they sank. It's very critical to demonstrate that, that the concept of these places is, is so important, and um, this is our opportunity to do a project that where we can show that to, to the world and hopefully get people excited about, um, about conserving uh, um, ocean, uh, the ocean environment.